Welcome children to the craft class. Today, me, Saroj Mami is here to teach you how to make this type of origami lotus flower. See? Children, to make this type of uh, origami lotus flower, we need a for size colorful paper. Okay? Uh, these three, same color, three paper. Okay? A for size three paper. One, two, three. And next color, we need another color, only one, to make the sepals or calyx of the flower. And this three pink paper I took for making the petals of the flower. This type of. See ya. Now what we have, first of all, what you have to do is take a one A4 paper and you have to fold from long side, not from this, not from this side, from long side you have to fold into half, one siding this line over this line and again fold this paper, this uh, shape into half overlapping this line over this line in this way ok now make a crease properly now we are going to separate each and every piece 1 2 3 and 4 now I am going to fold and I am going to cut here when we cut here we will get two pieces at once if you have a paper cutter, you can cut with a paper cutter. Okay, now I got four pieces of paper with a one A4 paper. Okay, now cut. Now I keep this on one side and I took two papers. This also you I am going to keep this on one side. Now I am going to cut this which we I am going to make this sepals. Okay, sepals. Uh, for this I need only one paper. One paper is enough. Now fold same way like a pink paper. You fold this green also into half from long side half. Now again half and cut cut all the pieces. See one, two, three, four. Separate all the pieces. into half okay one side this line over this line now we have a middle line here and what I we have to do is now this is a middle line, I am going to fold this, overlapping this line up to here in this way. And this line also overlap here in this way. And now this side finish, now here this side also, on this side also same way, fold in this way. Overlap this line over this middle line. Turn and again fold, overlap this line over this line. Okay, now we have a, this type of a shape. Okay, now I am going to fold here. Here in this way, before folding in this way, you have to fold this half, this half, this one, fold up to here in this way. See. 
overlap this line over this mini line again turn and this part also fold this line over up to here middle line now this is our shape now again this fold into half keeping this folded part inside in this way okay now we have this type of a shape see okay don't fold in this way don't fold in this way fold keeping this folded part inside it should be pointed now okay all the pieces you fold I will show you this is the middle line okay by marking with the sign pen okay we have a middle line of this shape now okay I am going to fold this corner this line overlapping here in this way and this part also same way and here on this side finish now on this side in this side. okay now you have to fold this line up to here in this way okay turn and again this part left, this also fold from this line overlap on up to here. In this way. Now you have to fold here, keeping this folded part inside. In this way. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve pieces finished. Now I am going to fold this green one, which we are going to make the sepals. Same way, you have to fold like this, green also. Now I have finished folding all these papers. Now we do what we have to do is now 
keep this three in see in this way one two one two three okay, three and one we have to give one green in this way. one Have a one, two, three, four groups of these strips. Now, what we are going to do is we keep in this way. All arrangements, all should be in the same height. One. One, two, three. Keep in this way. One, two, three, four. One, you have, you are going to wrap this with a cello uh, tape, small cello tape. Okay, that's why you have to wrap at the center of this uh, uh, strip. Okay, that's why you have to mark in this way where you are going to. I have already marked this is the place where we are going to wrap the cello tape. This and this should be equal with each other. Okay, now each and every this bundle should be in the same height. You hold in this way. One, two, one, two, three, four. Now I am taking cello tape. Now what you have to do is you stick here. See here. Here at the center of this long side in this way you have to keep properly all all hold properly and you tightly wrap wrap with cello tape in this way you make a three four round of this cello tape already tighten now you cut with a scissor keep on one place now see this is our bundle now what you have to do is you have to open in this way yeah one from this side another from this side in this way and here Again, this open. Let me see. Okay, now this. Now we have to see what you are now. You have already open. Yes. Now what you have to do is you take a one one bundle, and you do in this way. See, one bundle. Take, we have a one, two, three, four petals, uh, three petals and one sepal. Yes, now I am going to open this first row. One, one, I am taking one from here. Okay, what to do? See, I am opening this one in this way. Okay. Now I am opening this one. Take take one petal from this bundle 
and I am opening C. Don't tear here, okay? You have to open in this way. C. Now, this time you have to open. See, this is the folding. You have to open in this way. See here. And what you have to do is you have to see put a small amount of the glue here and you stick in this way. And again you put you open this open this one see here and you put a glue over here and you open this also and stick one petal from one one side from one petal and another side from another petal Okay, now we have lifted the innermost part. See here, this innermost part. Eh? Now I am lifting the second number of the petal here. This is the first number of petal, this is second number of petal, and this is third number of petal. Now I am lifting this second number by opening. See here. Here I have a foliar. See. I am opening this petal in this way. Opening the petal and a little bit foliar. In this way. Okay, now I have already opened all the petals, second layer. Now I am going to open the third layer. This is the second layer, now third layer. Same way. children I have already opened and you have to fold little bit up okay now these are the sepals you can keep little only little little fold don't fold more okay because these are the petal sepals fold in this way Okay children, now I have finished opening this, here we are going to stick the petals of the first, first layer and second layer and third layer you don't have to stick with each other and see here, now I have already made this lotus flower, okay children now I hope you can make this origami lotus flower by yourself properly okay children see you next class bye bye